I'm with Orla and Evie from Kingsley Power Under 11s after round two of the ENG Youth Netball Premier League Under 12s Northern Conference. Um, first game today was against, remind me, Oldham. It was against Oldham. Of course, it was against Oldham. So, as you know, it was going to always going to be a tough game. So, what was the aim coming into that game? Do you, did you generally feel you could win that game, or was it to score a certain amount of points to get a certain amount of turnovers, or was it just to learn? Give me your perception or what your aim was in that I'd game. Say it was just for our team to try to do their best. In, like, in what particular way? It just across the court. Across all the court. Yeah. Like just everybody tried to do their full game and try to turn some balls over. You're a mid-court player, right? Yeah. So, in your head, what is it you want to particularly achieve within that game to make sure you've had a successful time? Feeding into the shooting circle and making sure that the shooters get the shots in and helping them get the passes. And, and what, what kind of... Um, see, I don't really ask it. I mean, you're the first person this sort of question I ask. But what is it you have to do to kind of come across that you've got the better of your opposite number? So, who would be defending you? What, what player? Another centre. Another centre, so two centres. So what would you? Have, so is it just whoever feeds the most um, plays into the into the shooter or into the wing attack, or is it cutting cutting the ball out to each other? How yeah, does that like work? Cutting the ball out. So would you use that as a as a way of identifying that you've yeah. you've got the better of your centre? Yeah. Cool. I never knew that before. We found it out. Um, remind me, what position did you play? Goal defence. So goal defence. Um, what was it like defending against Oldham? So they're a bit tough because like. Most umpires don't really see like contact, yeah. so you just have to let it go and just and when it's when it's their ball, just keep trying. And, but when it's our ball, just keep cheering on the team. Well, I've to, like, encourage them. I was talking to someone outside about. I used to be a defender for football, so I get how I, I understand how much work goes into the defending. I also sta also understand it's not a lot of glory in defending as well. It's always these shooters and wing attacks, isn't it? Yeah. But I was talking to someone outside in regards to. Do you feel attackers sometimes get too much? Um, they get the umpire gives away too much to the attacker. They yeah. don't allow the defender to defend as much. Do you find that when yeah. you play? Yeah. yeah. But otherwise, they won't score much goals if, like, if I get the ball lots of times, they won't score lots of goals. So, so would you like to see yeah. defenders kind of be allowed to defend more aggressively without yeah. being penalised? Yeah. So would I. I would love to see that as well. I bet Lauren would love to see that as well, wouldn't she? Yeah. Yeah, 100%. Um, but you played well. Yeah. You happy with that performance? Yeah. Definitely. Cool. Um, so you've gone and played Grangetown. I'm not going to lie to you. I thought you can get beat based on that. First, oh, sorry. I've got no, <laughs> um, but based on their first performance against Northwich, but you've gone out there and you look like a, a team that's not a year younger. You look like a top four side. So what was discussed going into that game, which helped improve your performance? Probably the same as the first one, just yeah. try your best. Because of the older team, it doesn't mean you have to beat them, but always try your best. And what, what did, you, did you think in particular you did better against Grangetown, which gave you a lot of success? Was it your shooting? Was it the, the feeding into the circle? Was it the defending? What did you do better? I think because in our first match, like that was our first match and we got, had to get used to it. Yeah. And then for this match, like we've got used to it and now it's time to smash them. Yeah, and were you glad you played the harder game first? Yeah. Then the so-called easier game second, or would you rather play Grangetown first and Oldham? Which was that the perfect way to I, do it? Yeah. yeah, the perfect way to do it, Oldham then Grangetown. So you're calling me perfect. <laughs> yeah, brilliant. Happy days. <laughs> but well done. Um, five games to go. You've got your first win of the season. It's getting. It's quite tight now. Um, we've got Berry winning their first games today. Um, Someone else won the first game stone, I can't remember, but it is quite tight. So, realistically, where do you think you can come in this league with, with five games to go? We're hoping to come, like, top five. Yeah. yeah. Or, like, top three. That's cool. our aim. Well, if yeah. you play like that, I think you've got a great chance. So, well done. Absolutely brilliant today. And, we will, and you're my team of the week as well. So, well done. Um, I'll put that up online. But well done, girls. We'll see you in round 